Hamilton, late stages of this one, nobody out in the ninth. David Sharp. Well, one run game, and now Danny Jansen, and they've got the no doubles defense set up. Outfielders playing deep, and fielders guarding the lines. There's a strike, 95 of that one. He's been known to jump all over the first pitch, so that seems like a missed opportunity right there. One run game, bottom nine. That misses, and the count is one and two. And there's a ball. Man, oh man, I don't know how you take that pitch. That's as close as it gets. Looking to get the tying run on base. Swings and misses, struck him out. He swung over top of the curveball. Well, classic pitch sequencing there to change eye levels for the punch out. That fastball on the pitch before was off. It was very competitive. And that gets you thinking that he might try to climb the ladder. But then the curveball out of that same tunnel just falls off the table and you can't make contact. Brian Reynolds here. And the first pitch misses for ball one. And downstairs. Well, an interesting situation. One swing, you can tie up the ball game. But if you're patient and work a walk, then you bring the game-winning run to the plate. On the ground, out to short. To first, but it pulls him off the bag. That's a play you expect your shortstop to make pretty much every time. Pretty routine. Hard to tell if he didn't get a great grip on it or the mechanics on him just broke down, but that gives this offense an extra out to work with. One down. Here is Yohan Moncada. Ground ball right side. Feeds the second out there. And that's all they'll get. Well, there's a lot riding on that at bat right there. A nice job of the pitcher to bear down, make the pitch, get the ground ball. Excellent piece of work. The Orioles down to their final out. So next to hit for Baltimore, Connor Norton. And the pitch a little bit low, ball one. Typically, the outfield defense will play a little bit deeper just to keep the ball in front, make sure that runner on first doesn't come all the way around to score and tie this ball game up. Kicks and deals. And fouled off. Tying run at first. The winning run at the plate. Got him! And that's the ball game. With two outs, John Shambi along with Chris Singleton. David Sharp. So two down and stepping in for the Yankees, Aaron Judge. Outfield playing very deep, not wanting anything over their heads. Judge over the top. These fans, they are ready to cheer about something. Swings through that one for strike two. He's dealing with a great two-strike hitter right here. The strikeout is not automatic. Kicks and fires. Got him looking, and he did not like the call. The Yanks lead one, still down 3-0. Back in New York, last chance for the home team. Here's the Yankees catcher now, Freddie Fermin. The why to kick the pitch. 
The Yankees Help. looking to rally. Help one and oh. A swing and a miss, and that's strike one. No, he's really working that inside corner with the cutter. I tell you what, I hated that pitch. So tough to get the barrel to and to keep it fair. And strike two. And a pitch. Out to short. With the throw to first. One out, bottom of the nine. The bat. He's that's two outs time. away. JP. Now it's the shortstop, J.P. Crawford. That one fouled off. Sharp, a 6'3 lefty, 225 pounds, and he was selected for the All-Star game last year. And a pitch. Gets a piece, and it stays 0-2. Fights it off, he'll see another. One out, base is empty. Swing and a miss, struck him out. Now only one out remaining. Thought it was a pretty good pitch, top of the strike zone. We're seeing more fastballs in that location. Hitters, especially with two strikes, have to be ready to pull the trigger. Dominguez stands in now and watches strike one. Swing and a miss, that one in the dirt. The Yanks down to their final strike. Comes up empty as he chases that one in the dirt. On to first, and that'll do it as they complete the strikeout to end it. Final line score tonight. First for the victorious Kansas City Royals. Four runs. Welcome in, John Chomby, Chris Singleton. Late stages of this one. Nobody out in the ninth. Juan Soto down. Just missed. Now, Boog, this is a real tough place for visiting teams to come in and close out ball games for a win. Everyone here understands just how quickly things could change that one's in there and a count one and two swing and a miss struck him out a huge out to start the bottom of the night but it's talked about a lot but a good high fastball in a two-strike situation it's just become such a problem for hitters in more recent years but with all of the emphasis by pitchers on developing that spin rate having a good grip on the baseball those high fastballs they kind of look like to the hitter that they're rising even though they're not but they're not decreasing in velocity and spin rate so very difficult to get the barrel on it and that chance handled judge out of the play well there's a lot riding on that at bat right there nice job of the pitcher to bear down make the pitch get the ground ball excellent piece of work for oh. mean the next to hit takes outside crowd locked in right now one run game here in the ninth that's in there and it's a ball and a strike one ball one strike swing and a miss one ball two strikes the Yankees down to their final strike and another ball that turns out to be a really good take right there but you don't want to end this game with the bat on your shoulder swing and a miss and that's the ball game this team has won the series with the win in this game today so you got your eye on a sweep it's not going to be easy to do when you're on the road home team is always fighting to keep themselves alive so you got to come out execute play really good baseball tomorrow to complete this sweep our final line for tonight. First for the victorious Kansas.
Welcome in, John Jobby, Chris Singleton. Late stages of this one. Nobody out in the ninth. Number 21, David. And now it's Jose Siri. Swing and a miss. With the tying run at the plate as we play game one of this four game series. Hits and misses. It's a strikeout. And there's another strikeout, and those are just continuing to pile up. His confidence level has got to be dropping. He's got to find a way to make an adjustment, move, get back on track. His team needs him. In there for a strike at the bottom of the zone. And a swing and a miss. Now only one out remaining. Well, it can be so tough as a hitter to pull yourself out of an extended slump, one that lasts for several games, even a week or more. No, right now, oh, he's yeah. really in one, so I'm sure his mind. This one popped up. Renhifo gets under it. And that'll do it. The Royals take the series opener here at home. Always nice to win the home opener of a four-game series.